So I caved and I found, you know, this gremlin at Walmart. It was the only one. I wanted the blonde one. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm gonna just be real. I like this line. I like the dolls. Don't like the playset too much. Good for a backdrop for this little video at the moment, but I do like these little dollies. They're really cute. I think Barbie did something. <laughs> but yeah, guys, today we're gonna be looking at the Barbie Extra Minis, and I don't know which one this is. There's not really any information on names or anything online at the moment. So we're just gonna call her Jenna Marbles. <laughs> this is what they would come like if you were to buy them in a store. They cost you around $14.99 before taxes, depending on where you live. The taxes will be a little more, you know. It's pretty much all this clear plastic. There's not much backing to it. So I think that's one flaw that I don't like is this weird capsule that's not reusable really. So um, if they decide to do more of these, um, I would like them to maybe not use so much plastic. By the top, it says a Barbie Extra Minis. It's in a holographic little fonting. And then you look in the middle, you see your doll. You can see her from the front and the back. There's not much holding this doll in, surprisingly, from what I see in the box. And then here is her barcode, by the way, just in case you're looking for a screenshot this now. It says these are for three and up. I would say six and up because they're smaller pieces, but okay. Another barcode. And then the rim has a kind of, I guess it's supposed to look like a rainbow, but not really. So it's like a Barbie Extra rainbow. And then on the back, it says Barbie Extra Minis and, you know, warnings and stuff. But yeah, guys, I am now, I guess, gonna go open. Oh, I'm gonna go open Miss Jenna Marbles and we shall see what she's giving. You already know what she was giving. So I wanna see what she's giving. Okay, how do I open this? Oh. Okay guys, so I got her out of the box. It was actually pretty easy. It kind of reminded me of like an action figure, very much that. <laughs> yeah guys, um, she's actually quite interesting. Let me show you what she comes with first and then we'll move on to the actual doll. Don't mind my nail, I know it looks busted. I need to cut it. So what surprised me the most about these minis is they actually come with this stand and it's in a different color for each doll, I believe. So it has a Barbie Extra Minis base. Here is the stem that will hold your stand piece. It says Barbie Extra Minis as well. And here is the mini clamp. And it's actually quite weird how you assemble it. So you're going to put it in from the bottom, light it up and then you're gonna just press it to the base. Yeah, that's their stands. And it's great because this clip won't go as the Barbie Extra logo up here. Cool, it actually keeps it really, you know, stable in there. So love that for her. Came with this clear translucent white bag that has a pearly finish to it. It also has a chain that actually moves back and forth. They come with two accessory pieces, so this is one of them. The bag does not have any openings, so you can't put anything in it. The second thing we got are these fire sunglasses. They are orange. And now we're gonna move on to our doll. So she is a lighter skin complexion. She has very big brows. I feel like that's just the theme of these minis. She has dark brown eyebrows. She has green eyes, and there's some glitter in them. I'm not sure if the others have this glitter, but okay. <laughs> she has purple lipstick, and unlike her, she actually has earrings and earring holes. So in this this one she has like a barbed wired kind of hoop and in this one she has a basic stud both are a silver metallic color and i actually do like these earrings a lot i actually thought that maybe this one was lost but it's just a stud so okay work <laughs> she has a light blue hair coloring i don't know what this color is called i am um, it slipped my mind but it is soft hair it is polypropylene of course it has a wave to it as well and if i take her beanie off on the side she has a side shave it's brown and it actually is flock i was surprised it was flocked because Mattel recently doesn't really flock their dolls anymore. They just paint it and I never like that. So yay. As for her beanie, she has a dark blue beanie that has a green smiley face on the side. <clears throat> Now, I, I do wish this was like made of a cloth material and I believe that there's another doll in this line that has a beanie and it's actually like soft. So I really wish that they did that for her. Yeah, this would have been better if it was an actual knit material. So bummer. And by the way, guys, these dolls actually have lots of rooting. Um, it's a little thin right here near her flocking, but a majority of it is pretty thick. Um, is it good hair? No. And if it really bothers me, I might just reroot them. Who knows? They probably won't actually take that much hair if I did reroot them. So something I did not notice as well, she has a necklace on as well. It looks Looks like it's a chain collar that is also silver metallic. It's actually really cool. I really did not see that in the box, so good to know. If we move on to her outfit, she's wearing a two-piece set. It is a green cotton material that has these little smiley faces that are purple on it. The first piece is a long sleeve crop top and the pants are just these sweats with the same material. And then if we move on to her shoes, she's wearing some black boots that are full of glitter and the bottoms are black. So like all this glitter is like, is she like a chase figure? 
figure. <laughs> like, she's giving me Chase, like, doll vibes. So, like, I'm like, are you a Chase girl? But yeah, guys, now let me take her clothes off just in case you're not familiar with their articulation and all that jazz. So, the RB. Here's a Barbie extra mini naked. So the doll can move her head side to side. Can't look up or down. The peg in her head does not allow it. Her shoulders can go up and down and outwards as well. She has an articulated elbow and it can swivel around. Articulation in the hips and her knees. They also have a swivel right here. Her hips don't go out that wide either. And as I mentioned in this girl's review, the reason they probably don't have wrist articulation is for choking hazard reasons. Makes sense. Yeah, guys, let me go get her dress and I'll give you my final thoughts on my first, I guess, separate sold Barbie Extra Mini. So yeah, BRB. Okay guys, so I put her on her stand. She's really on there good. Like she does not come off it like at all. Also, this is what she looks like with her sunglasses. I'm not the biggest fan of them, so I'm just gonna try to take those off really quick. But yeah, guys, that pretty much ends this little review on a Barbie Extra Mini separate standalone doll. We don't know what her name is, but we're calling her Jenna Marbles. <laughs> Love you, Queen Jenna. Um, honestly, guys, for $14.99 before taxes, I think the doll is actually pretty good Um, comparing to other miniature dolls that are out at the moment. We're not going to count the LOL Surprise OMG tweens because obviously those are 100% better and are just better quality. But if I had to compare them to an LOL Surprise Todd, I'd rather buy the Barbie extra doll because like she has clothes, articulation, and a stand. But yeah guys, now we have two <laughs> and I feel like I'm going to be collecting the rest of these. So once I get the rest, expect reviews on them as well. I'm probably going to try to do all of them in a bulk review. I just wanted to do this one so we can see what she looks like because she is, you know, my first standalone one. But yeah guys, if you liked today's video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Anyways, if you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Jay and I do doll stuff, duh. And if you want to watch her review, I will link it down below in the description. But yeah guys, that is the end of this review i will see you tomorrow my omg hair video also let's name her in the comments because i don't think jenna marbles is gonna fly we can't disrespect the queen that much okay but yeah guys i will see you in the next video bye